Icon. Hey, Big Frida. I am so excited to be with the Queen of Bounce. Let me ask, are you going even bigger with the premiere of season three? Oh, yes, indeed. Definitely. Lots more drama, lots more action. You will definitely get to see Big Frida this season on a national tour going around the world. Me and my team, you will get to see us on a tour bus with a emotional roller coaster. Um, also, you know, being a family and, and sticking together, you will see um, me trying to cope with the passing of my mother. You also get to see one of my dancers try to rekindle with his mother, who he hasn't saw since he was a baby. It will definitely be lots of drama this season. Very excited about it airing. Well, Big Frida, I'm so sorry to hear about the loss of your mom. I'm sure she was a big inspiration to you. Oh, yeah, most definitely. She was the woman behind me. She was the force. She was, you know, who built me and built who I am today. Well, Big Frida, given how you talk so finely of your mom, what do you wish parents did to be more supportive of their kids? Well, I mean, just that actual thing, supporting your children in every way that you can and to be, be there for your kids, no matter through the thick or the thin, the good or the bad. Well, let's dive into some of the good, Big Frida. What was it about New Orleans that just was a perfect place to incubate and create Big Frida? Well, I mean, just the place of New Orleans and the spirit and the people of New Orleans and some of the struggles that I had to go through growing up as a kid, you know, in New Orleans, it just made me tough for the world and made me ready for the position that I'm in now. Um, New Orleans is, you know, it's a rough place growing up. It's a place where you definitely have to know how to hustle and, ha and have some talent to be able to survive there. Um, so... New Orleans is what helped made me and helped make me strong to the person that I am today. Well, you're a big time star now, Big Frida. Congratulations. But how do you handle the haters? Well, I just actually just keep it pushing. The haters, I have so many positive people around me and surround myself with positive energy. I don't have time for the haters. We're going to just let the haters be the haters. <laughs> That's great advice. I think we all need to hear that. Surround ourselves with positive people. But tell us about your partnership with the Fuse Network. Uh, just an amazing network. You know, like I said, putting all of the support behind me and you know, taking a chance on my career and on me and my team. I'm just very grateful for the network, for just putting all of the love that they give me um, on the show and just making people aware of the show around the world. We picked up millions of fans, and this season we definitely will pick up a couple of more million. No doubt indeed. Your fan base is growing, and it's growing for a really good reason. But uh, on a personal note, I have a, a question. When did you go from Frida to Big Frida? Um, well, it, it varies. Um, you know, some people still use the Big Frida and some people still, you know, call me Frida now. Um, I was a little bit bigger with my weight um, back then when I was Big Frida. <laughs> a lot bigger, rather. <laughs> so now I have slimmed and trimmed down for all those years of working on the stage. <laughs> Um, so some people just call me Frida, some people call me Big Frida. It really doesn't matter. I'm all of that and then some. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Big Frida, you are indeed. Any last words? <laughs> Big Frida, Queen of Bounce, season three. We are here, baby. Tune in and you will definitely not regret it. Well, Big Frida, I certainly will. Count me amongst your newest fans. I really adore your ability to be genuine, authentic, and bring such joy. Uh, I look forward to seeing the series. Congratulations on season three. Thank you so much, Con. Appreciate it.